Hello from London, my new town, my new neighborhood. Right now, I'm just down the street from where Connor and I are living, and I've only been here a few days. There's already so much I wanna show you guys. But first, the weekend before I came to London, I visited the one and only Julie Noki in her town of Toronto. Here, let me show you. Julie, the Torontonian. Is that the name? Yeah, that's how you say it. Okay, great. The Torontonian has been informing me about all this stuff Toronto, including the awesome fusion restaurants they have here. And it's not your typical fusion, right? No, no, the city's kind of known for it. It's like a melting pot of cultures. And we're headed to a neighborhood right now where um, there's all these unconventional kind of fusions of cultures. We make an Italian. That one's called Rasta Pasta. We can do Hungarian and Thai food. Syrian Caribbean connection. So we'll just have to like play by ear, whatever you want to try. Let's play by ear. You ready, Kensington? The Q Katie Feeling Peckish squad is coming at you. Oh, so this isn't the first time we've done this. No, this is not the first time that we have covered a city and eaten our way through it. How many years ago? Two years ago? I think I two visited years ago. Katie in New York. We're gonna take a field trip. Yeah. And we're gonna bring these guys along with us. You guys. And she took me to her favorite pizza spots. That was an ambitious day when I think back. We ate so much pizza. We learned our lesson. We learned our but lesson. But today is different. Different weather, different atmosphere, and different city. Hey. I had the opportunity to show Katie all around Toronto. And there is so much to see in Kensington alone. There's a store with British food and culture specialty items. There was this awesome cookbook store. And guess what book we spotted? My Avocados cookbook. Oh shit. <laughs> Who made that? <laughs> Who did that? You know the dealio. <laughs> I want to take Katie to two of my favorite restaurants. They I want to definitely so check out a fusion restaurant. Yes, I've got definitely. a really cool one in mind. And then we're going to go check out kind of my favorite restaurant in this area. But that'll be on my channel. Yes. Julie is taking me to the Jamaican Italian food fusion spot called Arasta Pasta. I've never thought of those two cuisines being compatible. But oh man, were my eyes open. And I love a sign they have up in the restaurant. They say their mission is providing food for all cultures to enjoy. All the menu options looked amazing. So which one did we end up getting? It's jerk chicken lasagna. And he was like, do you want hot sauce? And I always know if Jamaicans ask you if you want hot sauce, you say, can I try it first? <laughs> is it hot hot? Can I try a little bit, like on my hand? Well, not either. I don't see any chance of that happening. Woo! Just on the side is fine. Yeah. On yep. the side, a little bit on the side. Because <laughs> it's usually really intense. Woo! I just tried some of the hot sauce. Cheers, <laughs> Jazz. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god. I mean, this is so freaking good. Oh wow. The kick from the spice. They're not joking around. There's heat even without the hot sauce. That's the jerk chicken aspect though. Creamy. So creamy. Boing, 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 boing. I've been really trying. Just two men sharing a lasagna. <laughs> oh yeah, no, it's good. Would you get some of the hot sauce? Yeah, I got a lot of hot sauce. Yeah, you did. <laughs> yeah, I got a lot of hot sauce. Yeah. This is like the best part about living in like big cities. One mm. of the best parts is that you get all these different cultures oh, working yeah. together, creating things mm. that have never seen the light of day before. And he threw in a drumstick for us too. Oh my God, it is good. Just two ladies sharing a drumstick <laughs> on the street. That's all we are today. That's all I need to be in this life. This is not our only meal midday today. We're no about way, to go eat more. Yeah, I'm gonna take Haiti to my favorite restaurant in this market area. You unfortunately have to go click on a video for it. I am going to link to it, so check it out on Feeling Peckish. Should we give them a hint of where you're taking me? Hmm. <clears throat> No, no. Don't <laughs> no even hints. give him the benefit. No hints. Them. And as always, don't forget, Julie, tell him what to do. Keep it quirky. Always. I'm sorry. I'm, I know I should have harmonized with you on that. I don't know how I missed that cue. It's I just... cool. Next time, next time. Always. Keep it quirky. Not our first time. Mm. Big thanks to Julie and Sam for hosting Connor and I in Toronto. We love you guys.